fathers of two students killed during last year's massacre in Isla Vista are trying to turn tragedy into activism. News Channel 3's Tracy Lair joins us live from IV tonight. And Tracy, these fathers are strong advocates for gun control. They are. They've become that. They spoke at the Isla Vista Theater behind me. Both Bob Weiss and Richard Martinez came together. They spoke for about two hours. It wasn't a packed house, but they thanked the audience of students that did arrive. Both of them are trying to reach out on behalf of, of Martinez's son, Chris, who was killed outside the Ivy Deli, and also Weiss's daughter, Veronica, killed near her sorority house. They say they're trying to reach a bipartisan crowd. More civilians have been killed in, by gunfire in this country from 1968 to the end of 2012 than in all the wars that we've fought as America, beginning with the revolution, civil war, World War I, World War II. They both wore orange ties and they're asking others to wear orange on June 2nd. That is a gun violence awareness day. They also handed out bracelets. Uh, the bracelets say not one more. And Mr. Martinez wore this bracelet and also the watch that his son was wearing the night he died. They just want to raise awareness. They say they're not against guns, but they're against the senseless use of guns and the way people can so easily buy them. We'll hear more from uh, Bob Weiss coming up in a special report on News Channel 3 at 6. Reporting live in Isla Vista, Tracy Lair, News Channel 3. Okay, thank you, Tracy.